Hi guys, this is Not Jokering Comic Reviews, and I'm back again with another comic book haul. Um, sorry for the lack of videos, I have been away but still collecting, and yeah, this video is just going to be like all the variant comics which I picked up for ridiculously good prices. Like, I haven't paid 20 bucks just for this one. I paid about like I think it was three fifty, which is brilliant for this. So this is Batman and Robin number four variant. Awesome cover. Next comic that I got is Batman and Robin issue number five variant. Like I bought these in a lot with some other ones. This one was the only one which didn't turn out too well it's a bit as you can sort of see there it's a bit like scrunched but yeah I didn't pay that much money um and came with the regular one Who cares about that one no I do actually I don't actually mind the regular cover compared to that next one Oh, I love this. Batman and Robin, issue number 6. Variants. I think these are all 1 in 25 variants so far. Batman and Robin, issue number 7. Um, not my favourite cover, but still very, very good. Next one, Batman and Robin, issue number 9. Not too bad. Batman and Robin issue number 10. Variant. Uh, is this the variant? I can't remember. Yeah, it is, actually. So, just... I didn't... I, I got these brilliant prices. But the next one, I'm pretty happy about. Azrael. 1 in 25 variant. Oh, I just love this cover. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. I got that one, I think, with the other ones for like. It might have been $3.50 each for all of these, including this one, because it was from the same seller, but brilliant prices. Next one I picked up in Comic Store. A uh, while back, I actually paid. I bought this one and another one for thirty. So two twenty dollar books for thirty. So I'd say about about like fifteen. But it's brilliant cover. I haven't read it, but looks good. Next one, Batman Endgame. Um. Batman 36 actually, sorry. Loot Crate's exclusive variant. Paid, I think 12 bucks for this. Which isn't actually too bad. For some reason when I ordered it, I saw some go for lower and then I was like, oh, that sucks. But I've seen some people pay about like 20 bucks just for this. I'm like, I'm not gonna pay 20 bucks. Even though it is a brilliant cover. Next one, Batman Superman issue 5, 1 in 25 variants. If anybody's interested, I have got, how many copies of this? I got probably got like 5, uh, probably 4 more copies of this. I got these for uber great deal. I still can probably get some more if anybody desperately wants this cover. Like, this is brilliant. I, I don't know. I just love it. Uh, what's my next one? Oh! One of my favorite comic series at the moment. Which is kind of sad it's going to end. Uh, Batman 66 issue number 2, 1 in 25 variants. I paid 18 bucks, including shipping. This one was really dodgily packaged. I need to give that guy some negative feedback. And... But, brilliant cover, 
brilliant quality worth it last but not least I received this in the post yesterday Batman issue number 21 one is a uh, 1 to 100 variant black and white variant this is brilliant I bought this off of eBay including shipping $26 like it was totally worth it this this book is a near mint except for this this that just oh my god that annoys me so much it's like a little bit of a tear looks like looks like somebody stuck some sticky tape on the actual like a little bit of sticky tape on it and then accidentally like ripped it off but that's not too bad for this I I don't know how much this goes for but I look at comic book realm and it says like for an mint copy 60 bucks I'm like whoa it's probably like a 9 or a 8.5 I don't know I'm not the best at grading I made sure staples were intact but yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you got this far, save the best for last. I love this book. It's brilliant. Especially for 26 bucks. Yeah. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. And I will hopefully be uploading some more recent um, stuff. Which I haven't actually shown you guys. So until then, see ya.